Welcome to the Paradise Falls Community Report. Today's weather, clear skies, calm waters, another perfect day in Paradise Falls. with the new PF, and uh, I'm here today on the first day of principal shooting on the much-anticipated Witches of Fenwick movie. And look who's here with us. Why, it's Rusty Sinclair. <laughs> Rusty, I'm looking around. Is it Halloween? <laughs> no, Tony. Well, what we're trying to do is recreate a real witch's wedding. Well, we even have a witch consultant. Uh, Pamela, honey, come here. Come on, don't be shy. That she's a real witch. Oh, yeah. Come here, <laughs> you see, we want to make sure that everything is uh, truly wicker. Oh, I for one love wicker. <laughs> she means Wiccan, and it's not. Oh. <laughs> Witches don't marry the devil. Well, they don't. It's just a movie. I got you some tea. Can you put it over there? Did the doctor come by? He said she just needs to sleep it off. This is my fault. I wasn't there and she needed me. You saved her. If it's anyone's fault, it's Braga's. You're gonna be fine. And when you wake up, I'm gonna be right here for you. I'm not going anywhere, Mom. I want to thank you for coming by. I'm flattered that a woman like you would even call me. I'm not looking for your services, Mr. Weincheck. I want to talk to you about my sister. Rose is a very beautiful woman. Does she know you're a prostitute? A personal escort, please. And yes, I think she does. She's paid you money for your expertise? I don't think I should be discussing her finances with you. So she hasn't? No. Not yet. And what does her bill come to, so far? Once on the couch, four times in the bedroom, in the kitchen. And one sleepover, and that's extra. Naturally. A thousand dollars? I want you to leave town, Mr. Weincheck, and I don't want you to tell Rose you're a personal escort. If you do what I ask, I'll give you 2000 That's double. Do we have a deal? What your sister and I have, it's not just about money. $3,000. Yes, you have a deal. It's so nice to do business with a gentleman. My share. We had a deal. Deal's off. You get nothing. Well, how come? Well, I have this little rule. You don't get any money if you tell the person you're blackmailing who the f you are. He had someone kick my head in. What was I supposed to do? Go to bed, Junior. I have the pictures. I can still f you around a lot. And maybe I should send them to the police. You're not going to show anyone those pictures. Because you're like your father. You're a you get hit hard, you fold. You want to gamble on that? If those pictures come out, I will personally have you killed. So don't play hardball with me, kid, till you got some balls of your own. $3,000. 
$3,000. Is that the way you say hello? Hello. I want $3,000. I'm not giving you any money. I'm helping you make a shitload by keeping your secret, Admiral. I think you can help me out right now with a little money. Unless you want me to tell the police you're not Stanley Mansfield. What's the money for? I'm paying someone to have sex with my sister. $3,000? She's not that attractive. I warn you, you'd be ill-advised to push me too hard for money. I'm sorry. I can't hear you. I'm about to read my magazine. Excuse me. Mr. Madison. Yeah. Hello. I'm Tony Barone with the new PF. Well, what's the new PF? Well, it's a, a local TV station. What happened to the old PF? Oh, we don't talk about that. That's <laughs> not then. That was Brick Madison, ladies and gentlemen. The Brick. Look, um, I can't pay you. I can't raise that kind of money in two days. You just, you just got to give me a little more time. We are making a movie here. Don't you have any petty cash? 200 grand is not petty cash. I mean, do, do you have any idea how much cameras cost these days? I mean, I mean, crew's got to eat. You feel like shit? You shoot out of focus. Look, Pete, you just, just, just give me another week, okay? No problem. Just add fifty thousand dollars to the principal. Fifty thousand, honey. Well, we're busy in here right now. I know, sweetie, but uh, Bruno's got to talk to you about the opening shot. Oh. Go on, go on. I'll take care of the mayor. Okay, listen. I told you once. You want to talk to the brick? You got to go through me first. Oh my lord! She just attacked your mother right out of the blue. It was a complete surprise. How long had she had her for? About three years, uh, since she was a puppy. But I have to fly to Krakow tonight, and I'll be gone for a while. Of course. Dog bites can be vicious. Mm -hmm. What kind of dog was it? Uh, Schnauzer. Oh, are they going to have to put her down? Uh, no, she's just resting in bed. Oh, y your mother, not, not the Schnauzer. I don't know, but I have to go. I understand. You are a good son, Roman Wynchek. I just wish that we had met earlier. But I, you know, I think the price would have been too high, emotionally. Thank you. Rose, you don't have to thank me. Yes, I do. You've given me so much, and you haven't asked for anything in return. And that's rare in this life. You want 200,000 and we just don't have that. Well, what's your best offer? Well, I do have these. They're worth at least 50000 And that's low ball. You could probably sell them for a lot higher. Not enough. I'm also willing to give you an investment stake in the movie. How much? 25% of the back end. Now that means for every dollar of profit, you get a quarter. I want a third. Well, there's three of us. I should get a third. I don't know. Okay, agreed. I'll have our lawyers draft up the standard contract. Oh, uh, one other thing. I think I should get a signing bonus. Really? What did you have in mind? <laughs> Why are you Canadians always so horny? It's the water. Nice house.
Wilson. He can send you to college. I mean, Prager's got money. Don't want what he has. I hate him. He's sick. I want to live with you. Really? Yeah. You're not just saying that? Because if you are and you, like, change your mind later, I think it'll kill me. Oh, thank you, God. Kiss me. I don't want to talk about blame anymore. There's been too much of that. And if we're going to be happy... And I want us to be. We have to look forward. Just you and me. And baby. We're going to have a baby, Billy. here nothing I mean who doesn't like the movies <laughs> so what's this supposed to be oh um a, a witch's wedding <laughs> are you an extra no no I'm just holding this for someone have you seen Pete no I mean of course it's hard to tell who's who H have you seen someone um with a gold mask on no is it important I hope not that's what he told you? He said he had to go back because of a schnauzer attack? Well, stranger things have happened. If you say so. Well, that's it. I'm not gonna cry anymore. Roman wouldn't want that. He wanted me to be brave. And that's what I'm gonna be. <laughs> You've been so understanding. If you want to move back home, I won't mind. That's very generous of you. Well, I never got to Milan, but I'll always have good Roman memories, and you can't put a price on that. Well, what was going on in there? It sounded like he was killing you. Oh, he kept pressuring me, but I got him to back off. I made a deal. No shit? Mm hmm Oh, you are amazing. That is my girl. Mm. He wasn't too hard on you? Well, a little, but I could take it. Oh, bye. Rose and I made up. I'm moving back home. I think it'll be better for both of us if I clear out. I want you to know, I'm not going to be blackmailed every time you need a few bucks. Relax, Stanley. I won't be coming after you for more. At least not for a while. Uh, wait. I made us a drink. If you need me, I'm going upstairs. Did you pay the hydro bills like I asked? Yes, and I talked to the chimney people. We also have to replace the sump pump in cottage number nine. Good work. In case you forget, this is my company too. And if I'm ever gonna leave this town, I'm gonna have to make some real money. How long before we sell it all? Um, not long. Here's to us, working together, cordially. Of course. <laughs> I never asked, what? Did George's brother really die of? He didn't drown. No. No, no, he didn't. It was poison. <laughs> you uh, don't trust me? My dear sweet Admiral. Of course not. Anybody home? Where's Roxy? She's not in. Well, never mind. I feel like celebrating. Give me a kiss. Mm. Mm. You're in a good mood. I am. 
you like a drink? Oh, I forgot. You don't drink. No. I think I'll have one. I want to celebrate. <laughs> well, I'll be right back. I have some champagne in the fridge for a special occasion. And it is a special occasion. Look at these. charged. Don't you want to make love to me? <laughs> of course, I always do. Will you look at this? I'm going to give this one to Roxy. Come on. Come upstairs just for five minutes. I want to show you something. I'm going to go for a walk. I promise you. I won't be long. When I get back, then you can blow me away. <laughs> So what'd you have to do? Oh, I had to give him my uh, jewels. Well, they're not worth 200 grand. Well, I also gave him part of the back end. Uh, one third of the profits from the Witches of Fenwick. Profits? But after all the distribution expenses. <laughs> oh, then there's the, uh, the uh, residuals and the uh, royalties and producers' deferrals and after our own personal expenses have been paid. That's the idea. <laughs> a little frequency of penny. That's right, sweetie. Mm -hmm. So you, uh, you want to fool around? Honey, we're on a 15. Well, honey, how much longer do you need? <clears throat> what the hell? Come on over here and see Mr. Happy. This is one of my favorite views. I always come here when I want to think. Me too. I've never seen you here before. I guess we think at different times. You look like you're having a good day. I am. How about you? Well, when I came here, I was upset, but looking at this view, it's hard to be sad. You're not allowed to be sad in Paradise Falls. I forgot. By law, everything has to happen exactly the way it's supposed to. Whether you like it or not. <laughs> Could you drive me to the airport, please? <laughs> station first. I need you to drop off some pictures for me. <laughs> hmm. 
Look at that. Sometimes you feel like the world is on your side. <laughs> and cut it! That's a wrap, everybody. Thank you for a good day. I need a drink. So that's a wrap, as they say. No more shooting for today. But as for tomorrow, well, the show must go on. This is Tony Baroni signing off for the new PF. Thanks. That's called a teaser. You never want to let them think there's nothing more to say. Hello? <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm sorry, my mind was somewhere else. I... Evidently. Have you seen someone in a gold mask? No, but, but I did see someone in this amazing kabuki-looking thing. White face, red lips. Did you ever see Mummy Dearest? <laughs>